Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So Lakme has introduced 10 new shades in their 9 to 5 weightless matte mousse lip and cheek color. So I went ahead and picked up a new shade from this range. The outer packaging is the same, nothing much has changed. It's the same standard peachy glossy finish packaging. These are the product claims. I picked up the shade Brick Bloom. This retails for 625 rupees for 9 grams. There's absolutely no changes in the actual tube packaging either. It's the same peachy um, tube with a rose gold cap you do have the expiry date and the shape name on the tube the wand is neither too long nor too short it's just perfect it's very easy to use and very comfortable to apply your lipstick coming to the sponge tip applicator now this is leaf shaped and it has a pointy tip. It also has a well in the center which holds quite a lot of product. So just a single dip into the tube is sufficient for multiple applications. You don't really have to re-dip it. And also the pointy tip is so easy to outline your lips and also to fill in the corners of your lips. The formula is that of a whipped moussey consistency. It glides so smoothly on the lips. The lipstick as such is so lightweight and comfortable to wear. This dries down to a very comfortable semi-matte finish initially. But as the time progresses, this can be a bit drying on the lips. So if you are a person with very dry lips, it's highly essential that you moisturize your lips and prep your lips before applying this lipstick. This lasts for a good 6 hours and after which it does fade. It does transfer a bit and smudge too. It is not I'm not sure about the lighter shades but this particular shade, oh my god, the pigmentation is so good. This also stains my lips so you would definitely require a makeup remover to remove this lipstick. Now all shades will not go on well as a cheek color too. But this particular shade, if you're a dusky skin tone person like me, this looks so beautiful. Uh, you need to work a little quickly when you use this as a blush because this dries down pretty quickly. I have not edited this part of the video. So once you work quickly with it, this blends very well and it is a matte blush. I'm not a huge fan of glossy blushes. I do like matte blushes. There you can see it's such a pretty shade. Now the lipstick is not a smudge proof formula. It definitely smudges a bit. Coming to the pros, this definitely has 20 different shades to choose from. The formula is very comfortable and it glides on so smoothly on your lips. It's very pigmented and it lasts on your lips for a good 6 hours and it gives a semi matte finish. Coming to the cons, there's no ingredient list available anywhere in the packaging and there's no color coordination with the outer packaging and the actual color of the lipstick. So if you have more than one of these, then it's very difficult to choose the shade you need. Hope you really enjoyed watching this review video of mine and if you did, don't forget to hit the like button. So until my next one, stay happy, keep smiling and enjoy your makeup.